In this video, we are decorating the wild styled happy planner for the month of November using some beautiful stickers from my friend Lowen who sent them to me in happy mail. She also sent me the sweet card. Thank you so much Lowen. I cannot wait to use these beautiful fall stickers and inspirational phrases on my November monthly. Hello, I'm Katie. Welcome to the planner channel. Subscribe to watch new videos every week about creative planning and productivity. Let's get started. I grabbed the fall sticker book because I needed some monthly box stickers and some washi tape to use along with our inspirational stickers over here from my friend Lowen. So let's go ahead and try to basically use my regular decorative routine, which is five steps starting with choosing a theme, which we already have picked out. It will be fall stickers. And um, after we ch choose our theme, the second step is washi tape. So I'm gonna grab this, let me move this up just a hair, this washi tape strip from the fall sticker book to put over this line, which it does kind of match already because it's peach, but I just wanna pull in a little more of these pretty fall colors. That goes to there, and then we'll just borrow this piece, maybe trim that one little orange block so we can continue the little washi strip. Here, let's just trim that off there. Add this right here to fix it. Step three is box stickers. And I saw a few fall box stickers in this fall sticker book. So I'm gonna grab a few of those because there are a few things that I want to mark off on the month of November. Let's see, I had a doctor appointment here. I want to write a note in there. We'll put a little pumpkin here on Veterans Day and we'll need a sticker for that also. Let's grab this one for Thanksgiving. And then this one for our Friday shopping. Okay, I need a couple more box stickers. I like this one in our colors. Let's put it here. There's, I have something to remember this day. Here's one. Oh, look at these boxes I just found in this sticker book. They have a Black Friday one. I wonder if that'll fit there. Let's do this because I will be shopping online mostly. Well, probably online entirely. Small Biz Saturday and Cyber Monday. I'll probably finish all my shopping on Black Friday. Right, I do have something to remember on the 5th, so I think I'm gonna grab this other colorful checklist. Let's put that there. Oh, I love the shopping list for my column for November because I do have a list of things I wanna get, both things for the planner channel, things for Christmas shopping, all kinds of stuff. So let's see, that would be perfect to put here. Oh, I love this one too. It's fall, y'all. Let's put that right there. Okay, I think that's all I need for boxes. So I would normally do checklists and bullet points next, but I don't really need them on my monthly. So we're gonna skip right to the fun decorative stickers. Okay, let's grab some of these inspirational quotes before we put on our decorative stickers. That way we can decorate around them. I wanted one of these horizontal ones to go across the bottom because we have a good big section from here to here that we can decorate. So let's grab a quote and put that down here. Now, I'm gonna move it to the top of the boxes so that I can kind of put the florals around the edge. So let's put 
this quote starting in this corner right here. That way we'll have plenty of space for our really pretty fall florals. And I tried to find a quote that kind of went along with Thanksgiving. This is about life is not measured by the number of breaths we take, but by the moments that take our breath away. So let's find, um, I want to put a couple more quotes in the month. Let's find some more small ones that will fit in the days like this. It's the journey, not the destination. Where's my tweezers? Let's find a spot for this one. I like this one. If you can dream it, you can become it. I like this little one here. Enjoy the moments that make you smile. Let's put that one here. Okay, that's it for quotes. Love it. Let's get our decorative florals. We don't quite have enough room for the whole cornucopia down there, so we'll have to save that for another spread. We'll have to use these smaller decorative florals. <gasps> Love that. So pretty. So let's grab a couple more of these acorn leaves. These are super pretty. We have one in that corner. So let's put one in this corner also. Maybe we'll trim it so we can put it in two different places. Maybe like right here. Okay, these are so pretty. I like to alternate the colors, so we'll put an orange one and then a green one off the page and then we'll trim the extra part so that we can put it somewhere else or save it for later. Maybe we can put this other extra piece over there too. Then let's add this one. Amazingly, this green sticker will fit perfectly in our corner. So let's squeeze it right in there. I love that it'll fit right here. And then this whole corner, corner will have little flower decor. Let's just trim these little extra little pieces that are sticking out. Love that. I want to add one more little green leaf right over here on this side. And then I think that's all we need on this spread. Maybe just one more. Let's add this corn. Then we'll have a cluster in that corner and a cluster on in the center on this page. That just makes me feel like I need to put one more sticker right there. So let's add one more. And then this will be the last one. I think this will look good right here. Okay, let's pop it back on the discs and see how it looks. your free power plan checklist which will walk you through the power plan system that I use for decorative and functional planning there will be a link in the description box to the planner channel website where you can get that and join the newsletter if you like this video be sure to subscribe share with your friends hit that thumbs up button and I will see you in the next video bye